to our dearest siblings. Welcome back to our channel. I'm Becca. And I'm Katie. And this week we are back again with Outer Wilds, hopefully dying a little less than last time, learning a little bit more. Dying more importantly than last time, maybe, is what we'll be doing. Dying more importantly, yeah. So let's get into it. <gasps> yeah. Big gasp. Every time. Every time. Alrighty. Well, so. let's get into space. <laughs> is the plan to go back to Timber Hearth and try to get into like the quantum tower or something like that? Or are we gonna try exploring somewhere else now? Um, I think we're on Timber Hearth right now. I think you mean Brittle Hollow. Brittle Hollow, Brittle Hollow yeah. Indeed. Um, I mean, if we can manage to get into the quantum tower in Brittle Hollow, I think that would be fantastic. Yeah, um, I agree. Although I will say, I feel like maybe they were insinuating back all the way in the tutorial that they wanted us to go to Giant's Deep first because they said that's where um, Gabbro or Garbo, as I love yes, them. Garbo. Um, Garbo, that that's where they went. I think, yeah, I think we spent a lot of time at Brittle Hollow last time. Um, and I feel like we learned a lot. So I think it might be time yeah. to move on to Giant's Deep. Like, actually figuring right. out what the heck is going on there yeah okay the good news is i'm pretty sure that's giant steve i'm also haha -ha, i am correct heck yeah. the also the nice thing is the more that i do this the more that i realize about like mechanics of the game like i need to use a lot less fuel than i think i do oh that's really nice mm -hmm. i i think that's one of the things for this game is when you start to learn how to maneuver, it makes it easier. Yeah, definitely. The music is so it beautiful. Is. It's really pretty. Yeah, I'm going to assume that means we're on the right track because they started playing, playing pretty music. <laughs> it's like if you see enemies, you're on going on the right path for like first person shooters. <laughs> yeah. There's pretty music. Oh, look, Ooh. an island. <laughs> so fast into the right place. Oh, yeah. Okay. Up. Uh, oh, I should probably do boosters. Mm. Huh? It might help. See, you thought this was a spaceship. It is actually oh, oh, a submarine. Oh, there's a campfire. Yeah, and there's Whatever also the heck that, is. that weird thing. Yeah. <laughs> The purple glowies oh, that oh. always send us out into space. Don't break, don't break, don't break, don't break. Did I land? I feel like I'm still like way above the ground. Well, there what? is one way to check. Like... <laughs> I'm in a tree. Oh, not again. <laughs> not not Never again. again. Never again. Okay. Get out of the tree. Only tree. No land. Only tree. Okay, you know what? That's fine. We can work with it. I don't think this tree is going to, um, kill us. <laughs> Hopefully. Tree. Hopefully not. It's not a part of the wandering to moon yeah. crew. I don't trust that mm -mm. shady lady. Okay, but can I open the hatch to get out because the tree is blocking um... it? Um, yeah. <laughs> yes! Oh. Ooh! Oh. Um, okay. <laughs> well. Mmm. Nice. Parking. That's gonna be fun to get back into. I, I, mean, I do have That's a That's true. So, to the campfire first? Yeah. I think that's a good move. Maybe they'll have some cephalopod medicine, because I am that, not doing That would well. be good. Oh, hey, gravity here is not letting me do oh. nothing. Yeah, this is me. Full boosters up. Wee! Oh. 
Um, okay. So maybe... Let's follow Ghost the sound. Matter. Wait, ghost matter? Yeah, ghost matter detected nearby. Unidentified signal nearby. Okay. Um, that's going to be not yeah, good. Yeah, that's dangerous. Yeah. This is probably where the ghost matter is. Uh, if I had to guess. Well, there is one way to see. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> um, yes was the answer. Bonk. <laughs> I'm out, you know. A little sideways, but... A little sideways. I feel like that's pretty... <laughs> per Ooh. usual for me. Ooh. Very sideways. Um, yeah. I, I rescind my statement. It works. It works. It does. It does indeed work. And that's all that matters. <laughs> Alright. Now time to get out of here. <laughs> oh my gosh. So slowly looking. Oof. Hey, so, problem. Okay. <laughs> I have to jump to get out of here. No. Um, F, I can't jump out of here. Can you, can you use your, um, boosters? That's an excellent question. In the ship, it's gonna catch the ship on fire. Let me out. Is the ship on fire? I don't think so, no. No. Oh my gosh. This is the saddest thing. Oh no. Exit! <gasps> no. Go away. Eh. Eh. It will not let me. Can you at least get to the cockpit? Uh, it's what I am actively trying right now. <laughs> this is the saddest thing. I... What do we even do about <laughs> this? Yes! Yes! Okay, okay, okay. Oh my gosh, fantastic. Um, so maybe trying to... <laughs> right the ship. Yeah. Yes. Just a little bit. Yeah, that works. Just a little. Yep, okay. Wow. It really took one small move. Yeah. <laughs> I thought we were gonna be stuck there and I was like, oh no. Yeah, I did too. I was like, well, let's find a way to die. Uh, yeah, exactly. Again. I was low-key hoping that I was catching the ship on fire just so I could get out of that situation. <laughs> well, if I set uh. myself aflame then you can be calamari again. Uh-huh. Look at that beautiful park job. Wow. Okay. There's some a fuel tank right here. Wow. And a campfire. Um and that's all that's here. There's a hatchet. <laughs> okay. Um, Can we roast marshmallows? That's an excellent question. Um, I let must me check. Know. No. Aww. At least it's not letting me interact with it. Well, I thought you had to look at the fire last time when you were able to roast marshmallows. That's fair. Yes, I can. I can also doze off. Does that heal me? Um, I don't know. Oh my god, I thought I took my <laughs> suit off. off. Yeah. I was about to die God. all righty yeah extinguish that puppy uh, yeah consume it marshmallow i think i might have taken my suit off because how would i have consumed that otherwise um i don't know i sure did oh um um get in the ship get in the ship get in the well ship. 
the ship decided that for me, if I'm being honest. Well, that's good. Hey, what's going on? It's dark now. It's night. It's and night time. she's moving. Exit ship to repair artificial gravity damaged porthole damaged. I don't know how to fix that. <laughs> Are you still on Giant's Deep? No, you're not. It says it's far away. What are the trees then? I I don't know what's going on. I'm just trying to repair this. Okay, gravity's fixed again. Okay, that's a positive. We're in water now? These cyclones have to be moving. They definitely are. Okay. Um. Well, that was uh exciting. Uh oh. <laughs> I feel like the buckle up while you wash the cyclone glass is pretty um, fitting. Oh yeah. I'm gonna exit to try to fix the ship um, while that happens. Okay. Just for funsies. For funsies. It's, we are on top of the camp right now. That's funny. I need to fix it somewhere. Some, some way, somehow. That looks not healthy. Yeah. I don't know. It's hard to tell what's shabby chic and what's just shabby. You know. <laughs> I do. I do know. Well, bad news. I cannot get out of the ship to fix it, in the sense that. I can't get up. That's uh, fine. We'll leave it there for now. And when we take it into space, I'll fix it then. Smart, Because that's smart. always worked in my favor before. Yeah. Um, let's explore this way. Okay. I, yes, I um, know I there's an un unidentified signal nearby. There she goes. Goodbye. Okay. Oh, it's just, it's moving. She's moving fast. Yeah. We're gonna keep going. I hope we find Garbo. Me too. I think that's him right here. What do you think? <gasps> oh? Oh? Oh. Oh. It is Garbo. Oh. Garbo! You make beautiful music. Heck you might yeah. be Garbo, but you sure ain't. Uh, nice! It's you! Good to see you. you made it here in one piece. The first solo launch is a doozy, isn't it? <laughs> first! Yeah, uh, first, for sure. <laughs> so, hey, don't freak out or anything, but lately I keep, like, dying repeatedly. I don't know. It's pretty weird. Oh. <laughs> Girl, Not you're so us. funny. What about you? Have you died lately? Or is it just me? Yeah. Yeah, it's... We're in a time loop, but that's yeah. fair. Time has been behaving unusually lately. Yeah. A time loop makes sense. Cool. <laughs> he is shockingly chill about this. Yeah, but I feel like if we say that, like, that's just stating the obvious. I want to know what he thought it was. Yeah. I figured it'd be some kind of fidgety time business, but I wasn't really thinking about what's happened to the shape of time, you know? But a loop makes sense here. Let's go with loop for now. That makes me feel like it's not a loop. Yeah. It looks like you and I are the only ones that can tell time's going on we all weird. I tried radioing Hornbells and asking if they died too, but they thought I was being metaphorical. Oof. Even if I tell Hornbells about the time loop, they never remember by the next one. They don't realize anything's different. And here's another weird one for you. Every time I die, all of my memories from the loop were played back to me. I'm pretty sure that's related to the big stone Noba statue I found on one of the other islands. It is indeed. 
I was looking at it, and the statue opened its eyes and started glowing. It replayed my memories like it had seen through my eyes, just like what happens each time I die. That happened to me with the statue at the museum. Wow. wow. You too, huh? Then the Noma statue must have something to do with why we're the only ones aware of the time loop. So, no glowing statue, no time loop awareness. I think that's going to be my leading theory. But if you find out anything new about the statue or the time loop, let me know, okay? I'll be here. Anyway, that's what's new with me. But hey, it's your first solo voyage. Kind of. Let's talk about you, you know? How's space treating you? Oh, did we actually find something? I, um, I don't know. <laughs> Let's ask. I found something. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> oh. No, we did it. <laughs> what you got for me? Nothing. I was joking. <laughs> no worries. Feel free to let me know when you find something cool, though. You know where to find me. Hey, where should I have explored here? Have you watched a cyclone for long? It started to hypnotize you. I'm telling you. They'll put you in a trance if you stare at them long enough. Hmm. How's space treating you? Where do I need to go? Help me, please. Here's something you might like. At the start of every time loop, I keep seeing a bright flash of l flash in the sky at the start of every loop. Something must be happening up there in the orbit around the planet. I said so. Uh, that, yeah, I think that was what I thought was the ship crashing. Yeah. What else? What else? Have you been to Statue Island? That's where I have been calling it. Seeing as it's the island where I found the glowing Nomai statue. Get it? Wow. I was on the beach of Statue Island. The whole glowy business happened. By the way, it's a nice beach for the kind of thing. I give it a solid 7 out of 10 for the Gabbro relaxation scale. Ooh. I want to know this scale. And Me live too. my life by it. Same. Um, <laughs> if you feel like checking out Statue Island... It's the one with two islands connected by a natural rock arc. Well, mostly connected. Anyway, you'll see. Uh, see you later. Where's the ship, though? Oh, just kidding. I have to talk to him again. I'm so sorry. <laughs> yes, I get it. They're hypnotizing. Okay. Um, where's your ship? lost it that's a good question oh <laughs> lol me too it's definitely on a planet somewhere i mean unless a cyclone came by and tossed it into space i guess <laughs> that would be pretty nuts i hope it's not lonely Aww. i can hang out with my ship yeah um i'm screaming okay so for sure this was the first place that we were supposed to come yeah that's gonna Death be ghost cave. matter yeah death cave but like I'm so sad that we can't explore the death cave because I want Maybe to so one bad. day when we are ghost mm, and we, we matter so. wow <laughs> yeah okay so things that they suggested checking out the thing in orbit around space which is kind of what we were getting to at the beginning of this playthrough yeah um and then uh, Statue, Statue Island. Island. Yeah. Okay. Um, can I run? <laughs> Jeb is so slow. He's taking his time. He's taking his time. What just if he relax. just likes to have a lovely stroll? Indeed. Um, okay. Well, let's go to the ship. Let's go try to fix it in space. And while we're out there, we can... Do you want to do this Statue Island first? Because that's on this planet and we're already here. Oh. Yeah. For some reason, he said, or they said Statue Island. And my brain was like, it's on another planet. I, I think it's supposed to be on Giant's Deep. Yeah, for sure. I think so, too. Um, Our ship's still here, so that's good. That is good news. Statue Island... Okay, so it's connected by... A rock arch. A rock arch. That's what we're looking for. Yes. Get in there. Okay, take your suit off. Why don't you take your suit off and sit a spell? 
slip into something more comfortable. <laughs> yes. Exit ship to repair porthole damage. Nope. nope. Um, yeah. Not gonna do that. Ooh. Get up. It's not letting me go. Oh. Go. Ha ha. I nice. won in the end. Okay. Um. Well, I remember seeing another island that kind of went floating by. Yeah. So let's go and try to. Oh, I'm leaving the planet. Goodbye. Oh. And I'm back! Oh. <laughs> oh. We return. We return. Um. So that's where we just were, because it's got yeah. the campfire. So let's keep exploring around this area. Do you think that's it? Um, yes. <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> Fantastic! You know, Statue Island is incredibly ominous. I'm not gonna oh, lie yeah. to you. It is much easier to land when you're looking out the bottom. You know, that makes sense. I made it. I think I landed it. Yeah. It's so glowy. It's lovely. It's lovely. It's lovely. Alright. You know what I think about a lot every time I say the word lovely? I think about the scene in Nanny and McPhee where they're reading the book and they're like, what does this mean? For that one person. I don't remember her name. It's not matter. All that matters is after they said that, it's like, it's lovely. She took her leveling by the hand. Oh, yeah. No, I think of My Fair Lady. And, and oh. that's about it. Yeah, that's fair. I mean, once you've heard Eliza Tickle <laughs> say lovely, you kind of... That's the only you sound you can you ever hear go again. back, man. Oh, wouldn't it be so mm. we can't walk through the tree. You know, it's interesting because there's a light there, so I wonder if the lights kind of act as a path. Maybe. I could be completely wrong, right? Yeah. Because I often am. Um, Oxygen detected. <laughs> yes, there are trees. Can I get above this tree? No. No. Can I swim? Probably not. Um, I mean, why not? Well, I'll since the gravity is so, it's Wonky. double. So, yeah. Yeah. So it's double what it typically is. My guess is I'll sink like a stone. So okay. So do we want to try the tree or swimming? Is the question. You know that is the question. Um. Okay, so if I remember the tutorial correctly, they said if you have a camera, you can see ghost matter. Yeah. I Do I have a camera? I have a scout launcher. <gasps> Hold I up. Do. Wait a ticket. Wait a ticket. And it has photo mode. Yeah. Oh, that oh. was really far. Well, I guess that works. Okay, take a snapshot. Um. This all looks pretty... Oh. I see some right there. Oh. But other than that, it looks kind of safe. Yeah. So don't go... Where is that? Right where it is, actually. Yeah. So it kind of looks like I, I threw it into the ghost matter. Okay. Um, well, we can try it. Yeah. You know. Might as well. I, my guess is that we have to stay by the lanterns. That would make sense. Oh my gosh, my heart is pounding. Okay, there's not another lantern that I see. Um, I, I would just give the scout a wide berth and keep following these crystals. Yeah.
Okay. Maybe that... retrieve it and send out another one? Yeah. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. I need to hold it. Hold oh, right down here. Come here, scout launcher. Oh. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm gonna launch her again. Oh! oh. Uh, hey. I think there's a lot over there. Yeah. Well, let's take a picture. Uh, okay, so it looks like an entire wall of ghost matter. Okay. Is right in front of us. Um, Do you think that's in front of us? That's what I thought. I mean, that's kind of what it indicated when it grew. Mm. You don't think so? I don't know. I don't know. It's kind of hard to tell direction. Yeah. There's no memorable part. Ah! I mean, I, mean, I can try sending it out again. Yeah. I could try walking over there. Hazard. Hazard. Yeah. I'm gonna go with no. But it did not say it was hazardous, hazardous over there. this way. Yeah. So maybe this is like the loophole to get around. Yeah. Where all of that nastiness is. Yeah. Okay. So, I don't want to go that way. We'll try over here. Oh, I gotta jump to make it. <sighs> I don't know how well that will work for me. Um, you just boost really hard that direction? Yeah. We'll try it. <gasps> we did it! <gasps> Ooh. Heck yeah. We did it. We did it. This emo, we did it. <laughs> Indeed. Okay. Uh, okay, it does not it's not telling me it's detecting ghost matter anymore, so. Ooh. We found it. We got it. We got it. That probably was it. supposed to take like five seconds. So but. smart. <laughs> I feel very big brain for figuring out in the end though. Exactly. You might turn on your flashlight. It's very dark. Yes. How do I do that again? Right stick, I think. Oh! What is going on? Oh. I don't know. Gravity just got weird. There's no gravity anymore. Oh. Um. Oh! Do you know where this is? Because I know where this space. is. This is the tree planet. That I was uh, rocketing towards. Bramble, uh, dark bramble? Yeah. How did. Um, okay, so what? there's some kind of portal going on. Are we underwater? Yeah. I'm so um, confused. I am as well. I'm trying to get out of here. Gravity's still at zero, so I should be able, in theory. I'm gonna go towards these jellyfish things. Heck yeah. Hopefully they'll help me out. Jellyfish. I need help. Jellyfish. Help me. Jellyfish, please. Oh crap. Gravity is back to twice what I want it to be. <sighs> okay, um, so I'm a dumbass. I would not say that's true, but yes, I do think that's where you were supposed to get back up. Yeah, I know ghost matter is in here somewhere. And I'm not gonna suffocate. It's just vibing. Yeah, because they should have made it relatively easy because you can totally fall through there. Yeah. Alright, well, now that I am nauseous again. Yeah, I felt that. Dream mean. It's my friend. 
Well, this is where we went into Dark Bramble. Yeah, if you go back, it looked like there was an outshoot that went to stone. You Here. Yeah. Let's go here. Trees detected. They oh, sure do be. Wow. It also sounds like there's another cyclone coming. Yeah. At 50% uh, fuel remaining. I can't get up, I can't do nothing. Oh no. Also, I'm underneath water again? Uh, it's a cyclone. Oh god. Here we go. Here we go. Oh no. Hold on to your butts. Oh, space. We in space. In yeah, space. so the calm of the storm is space. Yeah. That's really interesting. That is super interesting. I also have no idea what's going on right now. I think you could probably, because it's as giant as deep as 114,000 feet away. Shit. You could probably explore space from here. Oh, no, we're out of the storm. Oh. 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 What? Oh, no. Um. Uh. Um. Uh. 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 Okay. Okay. Well, we learned quite a bit. We learned a lot. We learned a lot about Giant's Deep and how it works. I wonder if different cyclones take you to different places. They might. Or, because that cyclone took us, those two cyclones took us to the exact same place in space. Yeah. Um, it might have to do with your location on the planet, too. Yeah, that's the other thing that I was thinking about. <gasps> that maybe if... Pretty. It looks like it's launching something. I I think it looks like it's exploding, but... It, it does. Maybe it is launching something, maybe you're right. Oh my gosh, okay. That, like, comet thing? Yeah, theory. That's in an escape pod for the Nomai. Oh my gosh, and yeah. the reason that we're in a loop is, is because it wants you to see it and save them. And go find and save them. That might be the objective. Oh my goodness, yeah. I think I think you're onto something there. Okay, that's, like, just a theory, and I could be absolutely big wrong. But, I mean, you noticed that comet circling the sun... Uh, yeah. The other time. I think that's what that comet is. is yeah. Because it's all the way out there at the very edge of space. Mm hmm And when we went to Brittle Hollow, they said that there were three escape pods that happened. Maybe that was the final third one. Yeah. Or, or maybe we went to... <laughs> started the reverse of the game and Brittle Hollow is maybe one of the last places that you're supposed to go and that's the escape pod that we find. Maybe. I don't know. Lots to think about. Yeah. I I think this episode was much more theoretical trying to like figure out more of the storyline of the game, which is really interesting. Yeah, and I'm excited because now we can actually have a plan of attack or a plan of exploration instead of just bumping around aimlessly yeah exactly so next time we can we can go for that comet yeah we won't chase waterfalls but we will chase comets sincerely yours mm -hmm.